ten D three A motherboard for uh, Intel with for six uh, PCI slots, uh, six PCI risers, cheap power supply. In, uh, in turn, uh, <laughs> Intel chip, cheap, thirty-nine dollars. Um, uh, power That's supply cool. splitter and push button uh, momentary switch to start from other boards. I'm missing a RAM stick. But that's about it. This Gigabyte H110 board. It's got the one, two, three, four, five, six PCIs. These you can use with the risers. This is a 16 speed, and it's got these two extra power lines for uh, PCI. It helps them out. Uh, what else does it have? Looks like a nice board. I've never really seen one of these. <laughs> and this is the seventh generation processor. Comes with uh, comes with this cooling fan. Look how they apply their uh, thermal face. Thirty nine dollars with the cooling fan. Cheap, cheap. I might use one of mine. But uh, because this is an experimental mining rig, mining you only you don't really need um, you don't need 2.99 gigahertz, huh? Sell around 39 dollar chip with the uh, you don't need a heavy CPU, you don't need a lot of memory. Four gig is plenty. Uh, just need to be able to run Windows and go or Linux and go get your stuff. And it actually doesn't require anything. I'll probably pop this chip in now since I got everything out. All right, I'll be back maybe. Well, that was quick. Got the chip in there. Um, I'm trying to figure out this, uh, the orientation on this chip. It's pretty cool. Nice. So, uh, as far as I can tell, this cooler, I can't remember. These guys just snap in. It's weird. It's a cheap little cooler, but if it does the job, who cares? the battle's done. I get some memory. That CPU with a cool $39. That's actually a decent piece. For the day, man. S100 bus, ED80 computers, LSI, PDP8. Uh, digital equipment could not use the name computer because IBM had a patent on it and stole the name. Nobody could use the word, the name computer is a, a IBM word. So uh, they came with the PDP-8, stuff for Programmable Data Processor, PDP. And that's where OS-8 came from, which is basically the operating system we use today. Um, DOS, basically it's OS-8, written by a bunch of uh, maniacs. All right, we got a box of these PCI risers, I'll check them out. Some of the things I gotta say about these Chinese companies, a lot of them. The packaging is sometimes better than their products. They're really good at packaging. Yeah, these are good. Let's see. No cold solder joints, no lumping. And it's got the heavy it's got the heavier USB cable. It's got the foam backing. Not bad. Six for thirty-five dollars. So that just under six bucks each. 590 something or somewhere in there. Yikes. So let's see how these actually feel. Fit nice. I'll buy that for a buck. It's got the SATA on one end. Say the data and the Molex. Holy Molex, baby.
feels a little floppy, but. No, it's good. This is the, uh, the mining system test setup. Two power supplies, splitter, uh, six PSCI slots. I haven't, I'm just, uh, one small hard drive, USB, no windows. Then I gotta put all these risers in, plug in a bunch of these cards, see what happens. It's a nice test, bench setup test. Extra fan over there. $39. You saw the CPU I put in before. Two power supplies. Extra 12 volts to the board. Set up for that. So, uh, phase one of the operation here. So, uh, getting nice hash loaded up. This is uh, getting to be a monster. Just experiment. I got the motherboard up. Got, uh, Two power supplies on a splitter. Got the uh, that cheap chip in there, thirty-nine dollar CPU. Got three boards going. I want to add the fourth one, but uh, and and uh, that drive's got Windows on it. So I'm gonna add the fourth once I get this thing running. I'm waiting for a nice hash two. And the video is uh, two. And AMD, you got to load the, all these drivers and the, the zip files. But uh, it seems like everything's working. It's going to be interesting. Curious, curious to see. I haven't even set up a really got these cards up saying so how I can balance them. I got them. So I got room for one more. And uh, we'll give it an experiment see how we do. I got the tempered glass on the, uh, on the Core 3. It looks good. I yanked Windows completely off this drive and reloaded Windows. And uh, I redid some wiring here. And it's recognizing the uh, GeForce uh, 9, 1050 and the 960. 1050 is the one on the end here. 960 is the first one. The one in the middle is a Sapphire. I think that's a, an AMD. It's not going to see it on this software. But my experiment's working so far. So I added one more board, my $77 graphics card. See if it, how it, see if it, see if it enhances what's going on. But uh, part of the learning curve. Since I added another card, it's got to look for it. See if it sees it this time. So you got four cards going here on this desktop and monstrosity. $77 new card. Old 1050 Sapphire doesn't work with this, but I'm just putting the video out because it's uh, AMD and the 960, which is killing. So let's see if it sees this new stuff. I look like I found three now. Oh, smoke. Found GTA Force 1050. Found GeForce 1030. Found GeForce 960. Found compatible devices. Yeah. But it found it. It did find the uh, the Sapphire, which is running the video, which is an AMD. So is it right now? Yeah, showing three. Shoot. Let's see what it says about this. Celeron GPU, a uh, CPU. 3930, 2.9 gigahertz, man, that's slow. It's an old chip, it's a cheap $39 chip. And I found a 1050, GPU 2 is a 1030, GPU 3 is a 960. All right. So when we had six or eight good cards, plus if I run some uh, AMD software, I can pick up one more card I'll pick up in the crew. Aerial shot. It's wild, right? I was always good with wiring and schematics, so. You can see, uh, automatically went to the uh, 1030 next. And it says up here, uh, currently evaluating GPU Asus GeForce GT 1030. It's got 1030. It's going to automatically do the rest of them. Once it evaluates and benchmarks, It'll, uh, it'll start mining. I 
instead of mining with a pickaxe, you mine with a uh, calculator and a slide rule. Ah, slide rule's obsolete. Forget about it. All right, guys. Got one fan blowing on the on the rigs. I want to get add one more to the back. All right, guys. All right, guys. The last entry for the night. It sees all three all three GPUs now. It doesn't see the one AMD. It's varying from a dollar forty-two a day to like two oh six. That's gonna keep varying. Added another fan over here. Got a fan over there, external. Weird. Here he is. And this monster rig right here. So now I gotta eventually take this all apart and do it again into a proper location. Alright guys. Keep watching. Thanks for watching. All the weirdness. I gotta edit this. I got no place to edit. No room. Uh We'll keep working on everything and I'll uh, keep in touch with you guys. And I'll try to, once I formalize this, formal, eyes, formal, not formalize, make it formal. Then I will uh, set up the new setup and figure it out and get back to you. Alright, guys. Camera's going away.